Alright, hey guys, um, this is Anthony from the Young Kings, and uh, today we have the Saints Row 4 Super Dangerous Wub Wub Edition to unbox for you. It comes with the uh, dubstep gun, the dubstep doomsday button, the Commander in Chief Edition, and the Johnny Gat Memorial statue. So, let's open this. I already broke the seal, so we don't have to mess around with that. First off, we've got some plastic that is very hard to get off. Got the game itself, Commander in Chief Edition, different artwork on the cover. We have a ton of plastic on here. Alright, so right here we have the Johnny Gat Memorial statue. It's a good weight. I mean, it's not like a crappy statue, but what you're getting for your money is decent. Let's see. We have the Doomsday button. And you get your key. So yeah, the button plays some of the music from the game itself, so it's pretty cool. And then the main attraction to this edition is the replica dubstep gun, and we're going to cut it right here because i got to put in some batteries for it. We finally got the batteries in. It took us probably 10 or 15 minutes to do it, but we finally did it. Uh, some things I noticed about the gun is, like these little knobs right here are adjustable but they actually don't affect the gun at all in any way. You've got this little, uh, like a disc spinner right there. You've got some other knobs that don't do anything. They're just for show. The other side's pretty much the same way. You've got the front of it. You've got your little speaker down here. And uh, this is actually where the laser comes out, which I was surprised because I didn't actually think it shot a laser out. And it's just for show right there. So now we're just going to kind of press the button and show you what it does. As you can see, it shines a laser. And as long as you hold down the button, the laser will shine. And these lights on the side of the gun will light up. And once you take your finger off, just the music will play. And it just stops by itself. So that's the dubstep gun. That's like the main reason why somebody would want to buy this. But that's that's pretty much it, guys. I mean, it's uh, MSRP right now as a release is $100. Uh, if you want to pick one up, you better try to find it because collector's editions go kind of fast. And uh, if you want to see what the box looks like, it's a pretty big box. I mean... It's decent for its packaging. If you want to see a comparison, here's the uh, game itself. Normal size Xbox 360 game compared to the box. So, Anyways, guys, uh, thanks for watching, and uh, we're going to hopefully have more unboxings in the future for limited editions because who wants to see somebody open up just a regular game? All right, guys, peace.